week is Love My Neighbor Week. First of all, that's so fun. I love that. Uh, and Renee Hollisey, our neighbor's executive director, is here to tell us all about it. Well, welcome, Renee. Wonderful. Thank you so much for having me. <laughs> this is great. Um, you know, I feel like we just still need to make sure we're connecting with our neighbors. It's kind of easy to come and go without talking to each other. And what a great place to start. So this week is all about connections. Okay. And just acknowledging that you live in a, a neighborhood and acknowledging that you appreciate the people who are next to you. Aww. And it doesn't have to be big giant acts. It can be um, just telling a neighbor you love their front door wreath. You know, just it little means a things. lot, though. Yes, yeah. yes, just to be kind. Yes, and we do. You know, when your neighbor does something kind for you, we were gone for a few days, and our neighbor put our packages, and we live in kind of an apartment complex, and I thought that was so kind. You yes. know, yes, and so a way to thank them, you know, is 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 just by saying thank you. But there's exactly. other things you can do. Maybe you're inspired to do this week. And we have this great list that um, people can email me or send a okay. note to our neighbors. And it's just really simple things if you're like, I don't know what to do. Right, yeah, so, how do I start? Right, so little things like uh, put a little plant on your neighbor's front yard, it, or, you know, front step and say, happy I love your neighborhood bee. <laughs> <laughs> That's perfect. And we were also talking a little bit about Rochester and what a great city it is, me being new, but just absolutely loving it. And you've moved around a lot, but you've stayed here a long time. I have. Yeah, and, tell us about that. It's because of the neighborliness that exists really? here. Really? Yes. That's that's awesome. I know I feel so lucky to have moved to such a great town and um, everybody is so helpful. Uh, the people at, you know, when you go to stores and all of those places are so friendly. So, yeah. And the reason that our neighbors exist is because uh, Mayor Hazama way back in the day said, Rochester is gonna grow, but we want our neighborhoods to stay close knit. Okay. And so that's what this is all about. So that's how that started. I was going to say, tell me a little bit about the, the organization itself. So it's short for the Rochester Neighborhood Resource Center. Okay. And it's a nonprofit that works very closely with the city and very closely with all of the neighborhood associations in town. So we're kind of the umbrella okay. of, for the neighborhood associations. And we offer resources for neighborhoods to organize around. And nice. one of them is this week. It's okay. this, the first year we're doing this. Okay. So I'm really excited and thankful that you're helping me get the word out. Absolutely. So if you're like, I've never heard of this before, that's because it's brand new. That's right. <laughs> uh, we took some other communities that did similar things and we, we learned uh, and we figured out what would work for Rochester. Yeah. And so really, this is really, really simple. It's um, look at the list, do something nice for your neighbor. If you get a chance, snap a picture. Submit oh, cool. it to our photo contest. Oh, cool. Yes. So you've even got a little little promo going, a little right. fun. And the winning photo wins a popsicle party from the Mexican ice plate ice cream place. Oh, that's fun. Yes, so that little, little you know, encouragement. Little incentive, right. exactly. And so this list you can get, you said, by emailing you. Do you have it? Is it it's, on your website as well? It's on the well? website, yes. Nice, nice. And it is just nice little things. A, a handwritten note. I think nothing is more, getting to be more special than that a handwritten note. You know, we just don't do that very it's often so foreign. anymore. <laughs> it is, right? <laughs> and I would like to just recognize, yes. we worked with a local artist for the art for these. This is and so these little doodle people, um, are done by Mixie Madness, who is a local artist. Cool. And I saw her little doodles on Facebook and I said, would you work with us for really? this logo? Yes. Well, she did a great job. Didn't she? They're mm -hmm. so fun. It is. And you match our set so perfectly. We were saying that worked out. That was just <laughs> magic. Absolute <laughs> magic. Well, thank you so much, Renee, for being thank here. You. And everybody, get in touch with her. Make sure you check that website out too so you can find out how to love your neighbors. Well, coming up in just a little bit, we've also got your local news headlines after the break.